Hi friends, welcome to our Spanish lesson. Hola amigos, bienvenidos a nuestra clase de español. El día de hoy vamos a aprender sobre el reloj. Today we're going to learn about the watch. Watch means reloj. We're going to learn how to give the hour and how to ask for the hour. Okay? Which means, ¿qué hora es? What time is it? ¿Qué hora es? Es la hora de aprender. It's time to learn. Are you ready? Okay. When we say it is, it is means son las. Son las dos. Son las cuatro. It is four. It is two p.m. When we, it is very common, but when, when we're going to say it is one p.m., it change because it's singular. So we say es la, which is the same. It is es la una p.m. This one is because it's singular. And this one is plural. What time is it? ¿Qué hora es? Es la una. Our this is because we're using singular and female because our is hora. We say hora. And it's a feminine word. It's female. Our hora. That's why we use the A. Es la una. We can say es la uno because our is feminine okay so we're going to say it is two o'clock how will you say it is two o'clock son las dos son las dos it is four o'clock son las cuatro First, in the hour, we have first half hour and the last 45 minutes of the hour. So, en la hora tenemos la primera media hora, que se dice de una manera, y los últimos 15 minutos se mencionan de otra manera. The first half, uh, half hour it's the one that we're going to see right now. So, let's put first half hour. Let's see it's 2.10. 2.10. Son las 2 y 10. Son las 2 y 10. For 30, for this is the first half hour. For 30, we use media, which means half. For 30, we use media, which means half hour. So this is the first 30 minutes. So if it's 5.30, we are going to say, si son las cinco y media, vamos a decir que son las cinco y media. Son las cinco 
cinco y media. So for 30, which means the half of the hour, we say media. Cinco y media. 5.30. Son las cinco y media. When it's past the 30 minutes, we use the next hour. We refer to the next hour that is coming. Cuando es la última media hora, utilizamos la hora que le sigue. La hora que viene. Let's see. Past, when it's past 30 minutes, We refer to the next hour. And we use the word minus, which means menos. We're going to say, for example, it's 8.50. For 8.50, we said, son las nueve menos 10. It's 9 minus 10. Son las 9, which is our coming hour. Son las 9 menos minus 10. Menos 10. If we're going to say that it's 1250, let's see here, it's going to be 1250. How will you say 1250? Because this one changed because it's, you're going to use la una. So we're going to say, es la una menos diez. Singular. Es la una menos diez. Okay, now let's go with the half hours, with the quarters. Half quarters are cuartos. Half quarter, we call them cuartos. So if we're going to say that it's 715, you know how we're going to say it? Son las siete y cuarto. If we're going to say, if we have that it's 8.45, son las nueve menos un cuarto. Remember, when it's our half, when it's in our first half hour, we say seven and quarter. When it's in the last 30 minutes, we use the coming hour. Son las nueve menos un cuarto. Okay, let's put another example. 115. 115, remember, it's singular. Singular. Es la una y cuarto. Es la una y cuarto. Always, for the 1 p.m., we're going to say, we use the singular. Siempre, para la una de la tarde, vamos a usar el singular. Es la una y cuarto. Let's have another example. Let's see, it's going to be 
4.30. ¿Qué hora es? What time is it? Son las cuatro y media. Son las cuatro y media. Ok, friends, I hope you enjoyed this lesson. And I hope you practice giving the time in Spanish. Espero que practiquen el dar la hora en español. Practice, you can do it. Even when you ask it for you, you can respond for you in your mind in Spanish. Try it.